There are three things every supervillain's lair needs. A skull-shaped island fortress, henchmen, and aerial robotic guards. So while the home awareness system from Sunflower Labs can't help you with your real estate or staffing needs, it's got the aerial robotic guard aspect down pat. So you've got the sunflowers themselves, which are vibration and motion sensors that can detect small animals up to 20 feet away, as well as be able to tell the difference between an internal combustion engine and an electric vehicle's motors. Once somebody sets off either the motion or vibration detection, the B drone will emerge from its hive base station and fly off to investigate. The B drone is equipped with a camera that can transmit visual data directly to your smartphone or tablet, as well as save it to a remote server for later review. So to keep the bee from crashing into either trees or the second story of your house, it's equipped with GPS, rotor guards, and an array of anti-collision sensors. The bee can either be operated autonomously, responding to signals from the sunflowers, or set on a regularly scheduled patrol route, or it can be operated manually using the associated app. When patrolling, the bee can survey up to four acres before having to return to its hive to recharge. Sunflower has also taken privacy concerns into account. Even when it's patrolling the perimeter of your house, it's always pointed back towards the center of your property, not outwards towards your neighbor's lots. The only current drawback of the home awareness system from Sunflower Labs is that you're gonna to have to ransom off either a prince or probably a president in order to afford it. The hive base station and bee drone themselves come in a package at just under $10,000, while each sunflower is gonna set you back about $500 a pop. Still, this system shows a lot of potential and promise for the future of autonomous flight, autonomous security, and UAV technology in general. Next up, finding some henchmen. That does it for us from the Sunflower Labs testing site here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Stay tuned to Engadget all week for full coverage of CES 2020. Thanks everybody.